Is the Tacoma louder in the cab or is the Jeep Gladiator? Let's put a decibel meter on both and find out. Well, good morning everybody. How are you today? I'm pretty good and I've had a question recently about the sound in the cabin um, comparing the Gladiator to the Toyota Tacoma. So I'm going to put, actually I've already put, a decibel meter um, on my phone in uh, the cab of both and then we're going to go for a ride. So first of all, we're starting out here in the garage and I have a decibel meter set up right there, you guys can see, and of course it's going to react to my talking. So I'm going to let it level out to whatever it is. There's always ambient noise. And uh, we'll shut the door, and then I'll do a cold start, and we'll see where it reads. And we'll do the same test with the uh, Tacoma here in a few minutes. So there was the door shut, and I'm going to be quiet, let that thing... Uh, level eyes, if you will. Now there, of course, you can see the start. So I'll back out and we're going to go uh, two different places. I'll turn the air off, first of all. There we go. And then I'll, uh, I'll be quiet, I promise. Um, as we drive around a little bit, I'll warn you first when I'm going to be quiet. And then we'll do the same thing coming back with the Tacoma to see which one is actually quieter. Now, before we do that, let me do say that inside the Gladiator here, uh, we do have a soft top. I know you can't see that. And, of course, a sunroof in the uh, Tacoma. So, not really apples to apples, but still, it's the experience of both. Okay, we're going to start out here just driving. You guys can see, and I know it's picking up the exterior light, but hopefully you can see that. So I'll be quiet. We're going to cruise at uh, 30 miles an hour. Okay, now we're at a stop, and this will give you acceleration from a standstill up to 55, 60 miles an hour. Here we go. cruising at 55 miles an hour. Let's uh, let's give it a little bit of gas. Okay, there you go. There was a uh, little drive through a neighborhood at uh, slower speeds, 30 miles an hour, something like that. And uh, you can see on the screen, I hope, on the phone, that it uh, actually gives you an equivalent as to what it's like uh, to drive, uh, comparing it to common things like motorcycle or a dishwasher or other things like that on the screen, if you guys could see that. I hope you could. Um, it got as high as uh, dishwasher or vacuum cleaner from what I saw. There's our test with the Gladiator. Um, sorry if the camera bounces around a bit, but there's nowhere to secure the camera in here so that I can show you guys the screen. So kind of had to just hold it up in the air in front of the phone. And uh, I also have the unfortunate uh, glare of the sun. Uh, wanting to close the lens on the camera, which darkens everything up. So anyway, we're gonna we're gonna head back now. We're gonna jump in the Tacoma next, and we're gonna see how it compares. I'm very curious myself to see uh, how it compares to the Gladiator 
with the Gladiator having the uh, soft top. So it, you'd think the Gladiator would be louder, but I think we might be surprised. Let's see. Okay, out here in the Tacoma, um, this should be hopefully a little more stable ride. The camera I'm able to fasten to the sunroof. Uh, so you guys can see with me talking, I'm going to be quiet. We'll let it stabilize, and then I'll do a cold start on the Tacoma as well. So here we go. There you go, you can see the cold start. It says it's equivalent to a food blender. Well, it's fluctuating between a food blender and a dishwasher uh, with me talking, of course. All right, let's go ahead and get started. And we'll see how this compares. Okay, here we go. We're gonna be approaching the same 30 mile an hour patch that we drove in the Gladiator. So as soon as we get up here, I will be quiet, I promise, and we'll run this off uh, down this 30 mile an hour stretch so we can see how it compares to the Gladiator. And we'll start that uh, right about now. That was the 30 mile an hour stretch. Now we're gonna turn on to the 55, 60 mile an hour road. Get up to speed and you'll be able to hear what it sounds like or what it looks like. Here we go. drop down a gear and do a little bit of acceleration. it that is cruising at uh, 63 actually um, I don't know that I see big differences between the two I'll be interested to see when I uh, upload the video I'll be able to take a look at both readings but it looks to me like it's somewhere between a vacuum cleaner and a motorcycle or dishwasher obviously it's higher now because I'm speaking but uh, I don't see a huge difference between the two. Okay, we're back. I can't wait to take a look at the, uh, the video myself. Again, I think that both trucks, the Gladiator back here and the Tacoma out there, are pretty much equivalent. Maybe I'm wrong, but uh, if I'm remembering from what I saw while I was out driving around in the video, um, they both seem to range anywhere from hair dryer to uh, vacuum cleaner or motorcycle. Um, I'm not sure they're really quite that loud. I've experienced all of those. Uh, but anyway, uh, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Which one, uh, which one seemed louder to you? And also, it's interesting that again, the Gladiator has the soft top, uh, you know, covering about half of the truck, whereas the Tacoma out here just has the sunroof, which by the way was closed. Uh, so I don't know, let me know what you think. Also, real quick, if you haven't before and you're interested, check out my other channel. It is Rob Motive, all about my 2020 Voodoo Blue Toyota Tacoma. Don't forget to click that notification bell so that you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. And do me a favor, smash that subscribe button on the way out. Thanks for watching. Stay safe out there. Bye.